for staying with us at STL Live. I'm Sarah Bernard, and we're learning about We Rise Up for Kids uh, with my guest, founder, CEO, little Michaela Norfolk, and board chair, her mother, Monique A. Norfolk. So welcome back, Michaela and Monique. And we were we just watched a video of your organization, We Rise Up for Kids, that you started as a result of the bullying um, that you received at school. And what grade were you in when, when the bullying started? At the time, I was um, in second grade, and I was eight years old. Eight years old, so yeah. just last year. Yeah. And so you started this organization to help other children. And have you been able to speak to many children since you started the organization? Yes, we are trying to get in contact with other um, radio stations and TV shows, stuff like that. Yeah, so. to reach out to kids. And when you've spoken to kids, how does that make you feel about what happened to you? It makes me feel happy because I know that hopefully they will get something um, from this and know that they are not the only ones. They're not alone and there's someone out there to help you. It's when you were going through this and you were experience, experiencing being bullied, you were really scared, weren't you? Yes. And did you sometimes feel like it was your fault? Yeah, I did a little bit, but then um, when I started seeing my therapist, she was like, well, why do you think it's your fault? And I just, I was just quiet. I was like, well, there's, because there's no reason to say it's your fault. And are you able to take that message now to other children? Yes. Mm -hmm. You feel powerful enough to do that yes. and help others. Okay, let's talk to your mom for a little bit. So as a parent, what did you experience when Michaela was being bullied and what can you share with other parents who may not even be aware of what's going on with their kids at school? Yeah, well, I definitely, I know that for my husband and I, it was important for us to take this very seriously. Um, we experienced some depression. We experienced a lot of anger and frustration because she didn't get the support that she needed. Um, at also, at one point, she was suicidal, and that was the worst feeling, you know, worst thing my husband and I could ever hear. Um, but what parents do need to know is take this seriously. When your child is saying that they are a victim of bullying, don't just laugh it off, don't just tell them to ignore it, because actually ignoring it escalates the behavior, and there's research out there that shows that. Mm -hmm. Also, it's so important to get them into therapy. Um, even if they just have one session of counseling, they need to get in and see someone to assess where they are. We had no idea she would be diagnosed with PTSD, major depressive mm -hmm. disorder um, as well. And so, and then end up being suicidal. And when she was suicidal, she didn't tell us because she was scared that if she said something, we might have certain feelings. So she told her therapist and that's how we found out. Okay, mm -hmm. so, and we, we Rise Up for Kids, the organization mm -hmm. right here in St. Louis, so it's mm -hmm. in its infancy and it's the yes. first year, but you found that this is, um, like Michaela was saying, a healing for you as a family as well? Absolutely, it's great to be able to talk to other parents and kids when, you know, she had her kickoff event recently, there were about 100 people there, and they're telling their stories and saying how this is something they really need. We've had organizations that have just been pouring in, um, providing donations and resources and all of that, and so it seems like this is a real need and it's something that we're happy we can we can fill. Okay, and how can people get involved? So people can get involved. We're always looking for nonprofit organizations to partner with that have resources to help kids who have been victims of bullying. Um, we've ha we have therapists who have partnered with us. We also are always looking for people to provide donations. Um, they can do this on our website, we rise up the number four kids.org. Um, and they can also purchase t-shirts like the ones that we're wearing so that they can not only um, ensure that a portion of that purchase goes towards We Rise Up for Kids, but also to ensure that they're sharing this message everywhere they go. Mm -hmm. Michaela, what's your ultimate goal with the organization? My goal is to help other kids who are in need, get them the resources that they need, and for them to just get the life back they had before they were bullied, and just to be happy, just be happy, um, know that you're not alone, and it's gonna be okay, you'll get through this. And you, and how are you doing? I'm doing great. Okay, getting better. Yes. Good. And school, now you're homeschooled, right? Yes. How's that going? It's going very well. I'm learning so much more than I was when I was in traditional school. It's been great. And you're learning about running an organization. Yeah. That's awesome. That's a great experience for you. Very good. Well, thank you so much for sharing your story, being courageous thank enough you. to come and tell us. Um, you're going to be awesome. You are awesome already. And But thank just going you. out and sharing your story helps so many people. Monique, thank you so much. And um, if we want to encourage our viewers, too, to get involved with We Rise Up for Kids, 
They have a quarterly event coming up um, 2019, just in January 21st, that will focus on giving back and being proud of who you are and rocking what you got, food, fun, and resources. So that's going to happen on MLK Day on January 21st from 1 to 4 p.m. at the St. Vincent Home for Children at 7401 Florissant Road. For more information, call them at 314-594-7435 or email weriseup4kids at gmail.com or visit weriseupforkids.org or also facebook.com slash weriseupforkids. Lots of ways to reach you guys. So We Rise Up For Kids is a nonprofit organization established by Ms. Michaela Norfolk, a victim of bullying, and which provides other kids who've been victims of bullying with positive outlets and access to vital resources. You can correspond with the nonprofit organization at We Rise Up For Kids, care of Monique Norfolk at P.O. Box 737, Florissant, Missouri, 63032. There's more STL Live after this, so please stay with us.